Yo, Miss here, and today I'm gonna let you know how good now 90 rated UEFA Champions League road to the final Nicolo Barella really is. So he stands 5 feet 8 inches tall, he has high, high work rates, his preferred foot is right. He's only got a 3 star weak foot and 3 star skill moves though. He's currently coming in at around 370,000 coins on the market, that is a lot of coins, but he looks like a very good card and can get further upgrades. It is a live card after all. So he can play centre midfield and centre midfield only. His club, Inter, he's got the Serie A links and the Italian links. So I've decided to stick an anchor on him, which makes him the controlled accelerate type i guess some may want to stick a shadow on him it makes him the explosive accelerate type i like control players a bit more so i'm going to try the anchor it also makes him a more well-rounded card and boosts his physicals as well so his pace in the high 80s looks pretty good i'm expecting him to be fast enough for the center midfield position he's got very good shooting for a central midfielder all around the 80 or mid 80 mark his passing looks Great, I mean 93 vision, 93 short passing, 90 long passing, I'm expecting him to his passing to be on point. His dribbling looks amazing as well, he's quite small, 5 foot 8, and having almost all his dribbling stats above 90, I mean dribbling 84, I'm pretty sure he's going to feel good on the ball. His defending boosted with the anchor up to around the 90, mid 90 mark, I'm expecting him to be pretty good defensively, inceptions, tackles, all of that lovely stuff, and his physicals now boosted with the anchor of course. I mean, don't worry about heading, he's got decent jumping though, stamina 98, he should last all of the game and some more, strength 86, aggression 92, that is good, I do like that. Some information on the upgrade pattern of this card, he's got the dives into tackles and long shot taker traits, I'll be playing him next to Vieira in a 4-2-3 on narrow in this team, so yeah, let's see how he plays. Nice lofted pass, what's he onside? That was a nice pass. <laughs> Dece oh, good save by the keeper. I was going to say decent header by the small Barella. Good inception there. Nice pass as well. Into the box. Ah, I've red timed it. It's gone wide. Oh, no. Good inception. Read that one. I timed that one and it went wide. Now <laughs> through your legs. Don't know how I did that. Oh, that's better on the right foot of Barella. I think if you're going to play him, play him on the right hand side just so he can be on his stronger foot. Lovely footwork. Came out the worst from Marchisio there. Great interception there. Kept the ball. Ooh, bodied. Nice. Oh, he's never winning that header, is he? <laughs> Good tackle there, I didn't control that. Nice pass as well. Really involved in blocking that. Did well to win that back. Oh, lovely pass. Good tackle there. Great inception. Nice ball through by Barella. Can we get away? Oh, that was a brilliant tackle by them, I have to say. Barella gave it back to them. <laughs> Ooh, I thought I was floating into the top corner. Probably done enough to win this game. Great inception. Ooh, decent pass. Ah, wild shot. Somehow got through there. Okay, effort. Good inception there. Is he onside? Brilliant pass by Barella. Ah, I moved the keeper. Should have predicted that. 
One back well by Barella there. Couldn't get into the box though. Barella, what can we do with him? Oh, I thought he got a trip there. Outside of his foot, bottom left hand corner. Lovely finish by Barella. Got into the box well. I thought it could have been a pen. Oh, Barella, lovely play to get into the box again. Very agile, I have to say. Top left corner this time. So after seven games, we've got three goals, three assists with Barella. Not a bad return at all from the CDM position. And if you want to see more FIFA 23 player reviews on the latest players, please make sure that you subscribe to the channel. But how good is he? Well, he's very good. I think we know that. But I do think he's a tad bit expensive for what he offers. Let's go through the pros and cons. So his dribbling, he does feel amazing on the ball. Of course, he's 5'8 with great dribbling stats. So he should feel great on the ball. So yeah, really good on the ball. Nice and smooth. His passing is on point. That is his highest stat. So yeah, his passing is on point. Accurate, long, short, whatever. His passing is good. Defending, he's quite good defensively. Interestingly, I just played with Danny Ceballos, the showdown card. And he felt better defensively than Barella. I don't know why, but he did. That's my experience. But defensively, he is still good. I just think Barella might be better suited to a, for a box-to-box -box role, not sitting in front of your defence. So yeah, you might want to consider him in a box-to-box -box role on the right-hand side and not a sitting role. But yeah, his shooting, on point. Obviously, nothing amazing. But for his position, his shots are pretty good. I mean, he got three goals, not a bad return at all. Cons, three-star weak foot, three-star skill moves. You want more than that from a card that is 370k or so now. But this card can be upgraded, of course. And if Inter do well in the Champions League, this card could get a five-star weak foot and five-star skill moves, but they would have to go pretty far or even win the whole tournament for him to get that. So mm, perhaps unrealistic, but yeah, physicals, I put physicals in the cons with an asterisk because he's not terrible physically, but he's not a massive presence in midfield. Yeah, he's pretty fast and nifty around the place, but he's not Vieira. You can't, yeah, he's just not a massive physical presence. He's five foot eight. So I prefer someone a little bit bigger in the midfield than him. But yeah, overall, 8.9 out of 10. Remember, this is a 370k card. So I just think... It's not brilliant value, but it is a live card, which is why it's so inflated. And I think it will stay that way. But yeah, he is a great card. Don't get me wrong. Right box to box midfielder. I think he's perfect there. But yeah, a bit expensive at the moment. But that is only my opinion. Please like, subscribe and comment in the comment section. I will get back to you. Take care.